is the final sandstorm. And here we go. We have movement. Hi Kai trying to place a hatch panel on the Red Alliance cargo ship. But we see that Eagle Strike has already loaded two pieces of cargo into the Blue Alliance cargo ship, quickly followed by Beat City's Robotics after the end of the sandstorm. Multipakis Engineering, or Multipakis Robotics, working hard trying to get a hatch panel. Oh, it looks like there's a hatch panel stuck in the player station. And it's slowly rolling out. Oh, there it goes, it rolls free. Over on the Red Alliance side, High Tide is working hard trying to get those hatch panels on that rocket. Eagle Strike playing some defense, trying to prevent them from being effective. High Tide has a hatch panel in their possession and instead they avoid Eagle Strike and go and score that on the other Red Alliance rocket. Oh, Eagle Strike playing hard, slamming. They slam Robot Dolphins into the into the cargo ship, and now the Robot Dolphins, they've got a hatch panel stuck in their drive. Oh, and there he goes, it falls out. But High Tide has already scored two more pieces of cargo into their other Red Alliance rocket ship. The Storp playing defense for the Red Alliance over in the blue area. We've got Monty Pockets Robotics. They've got another hatch panel. Looks like they're going to go try and score that on the blue rocket. Can they do it? Can they make it? They're lining up. They're driving forward. Oh, it falls out. 30 seconds left remaining in the match. 294 working on their climb. Looks like, are we going to see a climb on the Red Alliance? Can we do it? 14 seconds left. High Tide being trying to get up. They can't do it. What's going on? They finally see. All right. With three, two, one. They don't make it, but Robot Dolphin is able to get on the half. 66 to 59. A very close and hard fought match.